Geographic Information Systems Technology, or GIS, is a powerful tool for helping planners make smarter decisions about our urban environments. Hi there, I'm Mike Ernst, and I'll be your instructor for these series of GIS courses. The easiest way to think of GIS is to view it as an integrated system of components. GIS includes information about the real world that has been simplified and abstracted into a digital database, including spatial and non-spatial features. GIS is also the hardware and the software that allows for the analysis of the data. Finally, GIS also includes the user, who uses their expert judgment to produce solutions to spatial problems. That last piece, the user, sometimes that's left out of definitions, but really it's the most important part. The software isn't going to produce the answers without the expertise of you, the user. At the heart of GIS are maps. Maps are abstractions or simplifications of the real world that are indispensable in the field of planning. Maps are critical to helping planners understand and analyze the existing urban environment and plan for the future. Bringing geospatial data into ArcGIS is pretty straightforward. We can also do much more with data that isn't already spatially referenced. In this course, we'll discuss how to import non-spatial data into ArcGIS. We'll also discuss a few data sources and how to clean up your data before you import it. We'll talk about the difference between joining and relating data, and we'll talk about relational database management systems. Finally, we'll cover ArcGIS's geodatabase format as a preferred way of managing your data.